Hey everyone, here's a question on rational numbers. The question is, find 5 rational numbers between minus 5 by 7 and minus 3 by 7. So I got this question from the comments. Now how to find out a rational numbers between a two given rational numbers? So remember there are infinitely many rational numbers between a two rational numbers. Now the very first step is you have to check the denominator here. So you can see that denominators of both the numbers are same, it is 7. If the denominators are not same, then you have to make it same by taking LCM. So here we're going to avoid that step because denominators are already same. Now we have a number minus 5 by 7 and minus 3 by 7. So let's see how many rational numbers we can find out between these two. So when I write down this number, minus 5 by 7 and 3 by 7, minus 3 by 7, there's only one number I can get that is minus 4 by 7. So after minus 5, I get minus 4. After that, minus 4, we'll get minus 3. So only one rational number I could able to find out between these two. But here we have to find out 5 rational numbers. And I said there are infinitely many rational numbers between two rational numbers. So how to find out? So here I'm going to find out the equivalent rational number of minus 5 by 7 and minus 3 by 7. So equivalent means they are equal. So the number will look different but the value will same. Like 2 by 3 suppose we'll take example. It's equivalent rational number is 4 by 6. Now why I'm saying it's equivalent? Because when you reduce this 4 by 6, that is cancelled, when you cancel it in two table, we'll get back 2 by 3, which is same as the original number, right? So that's why we have said that 4 by 6 and 2 by 3 are equivalent. So here also, we're going to take equivalent rational number of minus 5 by 7 and minus 3 by 7. So there are two ways of doing it. One is multiplying and one is dividing. So we're going to not divide here because we're going to get the answer in decimals. So I want to avoid that. We'll just multiply. So when you're multiplying, you can multiply with any number. Here I'm going to multiply this number with 10 because it's easy to multiply. You can choose any number you want, but your rational numbers will come a bit different. So here will when you multiply, multiply both numerator and denominator with 10, we'll get minus 50 by 70. Now the same 10 you have to select for the second number because denominator has to be same. So 3 minus 3 by 7, multiply the numerator and denominator by 10. When you multiply with this with 10, you will get minus 30 by 70. So like I said, you can multiply with any number, always take a smaller number which is because they are easy to multiply. One more point, when you take a number, always take a greater number because when you multiply, the gap between these two numbers will be more and more rational numbers you will get. Now here we got minus 50 by 70 and minus 30 by 70. Between these two numbers, we have a many numbers like starting from minus 49 by 70 and then minus 48 by 70. So first is minus 49 by 70. And then we have minus 48 by 70. So on up to minus 31 upon 70. So from this numbers, we can just select any 5 rational numbers because they are asking us to find out the 5 rational numbers. We can pick any 5 rational numbers and write down. Now we are going to write down the 5 rational numbers. So you can just pick any 5 rational numbers between uh, minus 50 by 70 and minus 30 by 70. And you can write down. So like I said before, there are infinitely many rational numbers between 2 rational numbers. So when you multiply, so here multiplied with 10. If you multiply this with 20 or 100, any other number, you will get different answer. Your answer will not match with my answer. So it's okay, but the, the your answer will be correct. But just it depends upon the what number you're multiplying here with. So I'm going to just take a five rational numbers. One is minus 49 by 70. Second is minus 48 by 70. Third is, you can take any number. So here I'm just taking 40, uh, minus 40 by 70. And the next I'll take uh, minus 35 by 70. And last, I'm going to take minus 32 by 70. That's it. So, uh, it's you can take any other number if you want to. I have just taken randomly 5 numbers. So, I hope this question is clear how to find out the rational numbers between two rational numbers. In case you have other question or doubt, you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.